Now at SeaTac Airport, Alaska Airlines beginning its first passenger flight on the Boeing 737-9 MAX Jet Q13's Brian Flores joining us live. Brian, with the latest. Look at that. Yeah, the latest right behind me. I'm going to step aside right now and you can get a look at this uh, Boeing 737 MAX 9. It just uh, left the gate probably about five minutes ago. They are backing this plane out. Again, this is the inaugural flight for this plane for Alaska Airlines. And it really is a really big day for both of the companies, talking about Alaska and for Boeing. Uh, Boeing telling us that they took a service of this plane on January 24th, of uh, this flight in particular, leaving here right now from Seattle, headed toward a beautiful San Diego, California. It's then gonna head back up around uh, 240. It's when it's expected to arrive. And then a little bit later on, uh, in terms of weeks, uh, they're going to add more 737 MAX 9s now into the service fleet. As we go to some video, if we have that, since the plane is uh, probably out of view, I would I would imagine. But anyways, Alaska's going to be taking in service of another MAX on March 18th. Uh, third and fourth MAX plane is going to be begin service on April 4th. And some of the routes that they're going to be flying this is going to be including, obviously, Seattle, San Diego, L.A., Portland, and Las Vegas. Overall, though, in terms of operations, Alaska says they plan on purchasing another 52 planes of this of this particular brand. Again, the 737 MAX 9 between 2023 and 2026. So as we take it back out here live again, a very important uh, day for Boeing, a very important day for Alaska Airlines. We should tell you that this plane is almost full that, uh, from what they tell us. It's not a completely full fight, flight. Uh, but we did talk with pilots, we did talk with passengers, and needless to say, they are very excited about going on this plane, despite the record that it's had in the past. We'll hear more about that coming up during the next hour. But for now, guys, back over to you.